Hey y'all, Tammy here with Happy Art Creations. Let me move you in. Oh, and then move that over there. There you go. That's better. I should have checked that. Anyhow, today I'm going to be doing, I'm, I've got a craft fair coming up on October 16th. And I'm wanting to do, I've really been selling a lot of the uh, functional kind of art. So I want to keep it simple on this. I found these jars right here at the Dollar Tree. Okay. So what I have been wanting to do where is my thing of tape? Well, anyhow, I'll just oh here it is. Anyhow, I just want to show you. I want to do a um, a pillow, but I want to do a swipe. You know, with these colors that I have in front of me, and I'm going to go over them in just a minute. I kind of want to keep them uh, neutral or modern. I'm going to call them modern neutrals because some colors are always in, and a lot of people just like these colors. But before I get started, I want to show you kind of what I did to prep this because I don't want this to have any of the uh, what's it call it mm -hmm, mm -hmm, paint or or resin on it okay I want to keep it silver and have the top just pretty okay so what I did was and it's not hard I have these little ditties okay and on these ditties um, they're little cups this particular ones, the lids, ugh, never fit. Never fit. So I use them to prep up stuff. So what I did was, just so you know, is I took a piece of tape <laughs> and did this. Just kind of made a double stick. Suck it, stuck it in the middle and ta-da. There we go. So it's like, like that. You might want to put, make sure it's in the middle. There we go. All right, so I've got that. Then I take a piece of tape, and I'm only going to do a little piece because I've already done it. I cleaned these off with some uh, alcohol, not just 91%. And I'm going to go around these edges really close. I don't want the tape above. I want it just below. So anyhow, you do, and I don't have my glasses on, y'all, but anyhow, basically, you're just going to go around and make sure if you can get it. And it's okay if this hangs over. Try to keep it that way because when you go to resin, and I will go to resin, it'll drip straight down. It won't go up underneath these uh, areas right here and that is a pain in the keister. You might as well call it ruined almost because it will be extremely hard to get off the metal. Well anyhow, and then I just go around and I put a piece of tape all the way around. Um, oh shoot, I forgot to do this. I'm going to put a piece of uh, this latex right here and I'll have to stop and let it dry, but I'll show you what I do. I put my latex, which is, I use the Creature Liquid Latex. That's what I use. I get it off of Amazon, okay? And I put it in a little bottle because it's just easier. And I have learned that it works. Take the, the booger out of the hole, okay? There we go. Anyhow, I just take this and I go around like that. And I want to get up at the top, but I don't want to get where I'm going to be painting. Okay, and the reason I'm doing that is I want to seal that area where the resin is going to be. Now, could I have done that before? Yeah, I could have. Could I do it before I do the, the, um, the resin? Yeah, I could. But I'm kind of going to do it at both. Um, I've had things ruined because... The resin, regardless of you putting down, you have the best tape in the whole wide world. Resin is sneaky. It likes to um, just kind of get up in everything, okay? It wants to get into your business, and this just kind of seals it up at the top. Now, I've already gone around and really, you know, rev push that down all the way around, and it's good. When this turns clear, it's ready. So, anyhow, in the meantime, while it's doing its thing, let me close this, and I still... I want to wipe just the top of my little lid off. I'm a little bit farther away from my table, so. And make sure you mark it resin, because you might mix it up with your other oh, white paints or whatever. Ask me how I know. Alrighty. Uh, get my tape at Harbor Freight. But you can get you can get tape anywhere, guys. Um, just kind of like that. And I've got some beautiful colors. And like, again, this here, we'll start with this. This is going to be my base. I did thin it down. It is thick. It is the Bare Paint and Primer number, oh gosh, Ultra Pure White number 7050. And I put five squirts of water. 
okay because it's really thick and on this I don't want it as thick okay and you stir it in real good it already has some GAC 800 in because I have a batch made and I just put this in the cup because I probably won't need that much and just some letting it sit okay um, my cell activator is going to be is it Golden's Onyx no I'll get back with you on that I don't remember all right this right here is my gold bronze by Lucas Krill okay I've used this before it's my like new favorite color it might need a little bit of thinning out then I wanted I used the Lucas Krill turquoise it was super duper bright I wanted to tone it down just a little okay and I mixed I don't know maybe a teaspoon into my little thing and it kind of it just muted it just a little bit and these have been sitting for a little bit so they're kind of thickening up but it's still a very luscious yummy color this one right here it's a beautiful it's called ocean it's naked fusion it is a pigment but it was super bright super bright also and it looks similar but it doesn't and I'm gonna put something in between it but I put just a little blob like a pea size a large pea size let's put it keep it a pea size blob of this uh, pearl uh, cactus green from Arteza. It's a beautiful color and as you can see oops I got big old bubbles now it is different. Let's bring it up. It is different. Okay and I think when we put things between it I think it's going to be really noticeable the difference. Now I've got another Naked Fusion Gold Jewel. That's what this is and see I'm adding different shades of similar colors because this is gold bronze and I'm also going to use, this is Ceramicote uh, Pearl Black, okay? I really, it's $2.29 a bottle, okay? Uh, I really have decided I like the Ceramicote Select. It is a good, uh, heavily pigmented paint. And I've got some other ones that I like, and this one is metallic. And it's just a pretty, I don't know, gunmetal kind of... It's very pretty, mixed up real well, and um, anyhow, I love it. Didn't do anything to that one, okay? So, while this is drying, and as you can see, it's almost dry, y'all. See? Look. You can still see some white, so while it's drying, um, I'll kind of get everything together, and I'll be back in just a few minutes. This won't be long. Toodles, just sec. Okay, y'all, I can't even remember if I said welcome to Happy Art Creations and welcome to my today. Did I say it? I don't remember, and I'm not going to go back and check right this minute. So, anyhow, this is an old Dollar Tree uh, frame that I practice stuff on, okay? Uh, canvas, you can get it for a dollar. And what I'm going to do now, because I don't want to get my big old tub out for this right here to spin art, and I can clean this off easily and so forth and so on. But um, anyhow, I just put some tape. I have these little things that they're not sitting directly on this, and it makes it easier for me to get up underneath, like with a stick if I've gotten so. So what I'm going to do is just put this on here like that to kind of hold it there. And then I'm going to put that in the middle. Oop, I do need to move this back. I've got stuff protected because, you know what, I'm a messy Marvin, and this I don't want anything that might get ruined with paint. Okay, and I said I was in this here's dry, so you can say that it's it's dry, ready to go. It is sticky. It's kind of tacky, so you'll feel it. Um, anyhow, and I said I was going to use my black uh, cell activator, and I'm not. I'm using my white um, because I'm using this color in it also. Okay, I am just going to swipe, y'all. It's going to be a little bitty fun swipe. All right, so this is just Amsterdam. Uh, paint and Floetrol and a little bit of Minwax. My recipe is down below in the description. Okay, so all right, let's get our our base, which is just my my bare paint. Um, not even gonna worry too much. I hope this spins well. I'm just gonna spin it a little bit, see how it moves, and I can just kind of go. Whoop. To the side, to the side, to the side. Okay, just like that. That's all I'm going to do. If it drips down, I don't give a darn. All right. So, here we go. So, I've got my colors out. And this is the black pearl. It's kind of gunmetally. Now, 
I am going to want to have a little bit more because I want this to take up more space. Okay. This is trial because I don't know. This here is my turquoise, turquoise mix with some of that uh, DecoArt, uh, what is it, sterling silver it mixed in with it. It did dull it down just a little, so I like that. All right. And it's thick, but I don't care. Okay. Isn't that pretty, though? I thought that black would be just really pretty. Here's this beautiful gold bronze. Again, I'm calling these colors more of a, a neutral color, uh, modern neutral, okay? Because, I mean, in all reality, think about it. A lot of people like these colors. Okay, so here we go. Let's add, you know what? Darn, they do look alike. Oh, shoot, that's because it is. I'm such a ditz. Okay. No wonder. Okay, I had my moment. Now you can see the difference. All right. Like I said, I don't care that I've got a lot of paint on here because I am going to swipe it off. I kind of like it that this right here, this little thing is catching this paint. I'm not even worried about it because, like I said, it's wore out. I use it all the time. And then here's our beautiful gold. These are Naked Fusion pigments. What was this one? Gold Jewel. It's a very, it's just bright. It's a brighter gold. Not really, it's more of a, it's not like an Inca or a, even the, the 24 karat gold. Um, it's not even like that because um, they're more yellow. I'm going to add just a hair more on top of this. Just a hair. Yeah, I mean, I put a lot, y'all. I want a lot, and I want it to cover the whole thing. And I'm going to use this little spatula because, all honesty, woo-woo, it'll cover the whole thing. Really need to clean them, but hey, right? Always shake up your cell activators, especially. I mean, I guess all of them are that way. I think this can be so pretty. Okay, and I do see some dots right now. And I did have some issues with dots, so let me see if I can find my little... Diddy, ow, not that one. Oh, here we are, this will work. These are just those cute little things that you stab in sandwiches, but they're perfect for this, especially. All right, that looks good to me. All right, so I am going to cover it all. I shook it up good. It's pretty thin. I can't remember. I know that I put. Um, I think more of the Floetrol mix in my white. Mm -hmm. And I believe I have that. It's in the recipes. You ready? I'm ready. Here, I'll bring it in. Let's get it gorgeous. Oop. There we go. You can see it now. Here we go. Oh, I hope. Oh, look at that paint right there. Where can I put that? Oh, my gosh. It's coming up gorgeous. Okay, y'all. Let's see. I'm going to take this. This is a thing. And I'm going to put this on it. So let's see how it turns out. Eh. It's not doing anything. So we'll just say on that. Oh my gosh. Okay. Where's my white? I have a little bit right here that I want to catch because that is actually on and if you notice look I'm just putting a little bit here I'm not going crazy okay and I'm gonna get this I hope it got it I'm wiping off in between <laughs> let's see this one didn't quite how about if I get my little strong blow a little bit I don't want to wipe it again. And there's a spot over here. All right. Not so sure right here, but I love everything else, so. Let's see what it does. Push come to shove, I can wipe it off. I 
kind of like these because of the rock. It looks like little rocks, but isn't that pretty? I love that. I think I, I think this one's coming up okay, but this piece right here, yeah, I am going to wipe it off, put something on there. It's coming down the sides, but it's not coming here. So you know what? If you don't like it, get rid of it. Okay, you saw what I did. I just wiped it off. And I'm going to add some more paint very carefully. Because you want your paint. You want it to look good. If you want this to be sold, you want the quality of your artwork to be A1. And guys, if you don't like it, then don't do it. I think I'll add my black from... I liked, oop, got a little bit of white in that one. Let's get that off. Okay, so let's see if I get it back in order. <laughs> and not repeat myself. Bronze, it's called gold bronze, not bronze gold. So I really like it. Then we got our, our beautiful ocean mix. down here or the gold <laughs> that's my kind of yellow right all right so I don't need much where is it right here I'm doing it away from my art mm-hmm why <laughs> make sure it's enough okay are you ready this is beautiful I'll bring you up to see it Let's see. Come on, babies. Not so sure if it got right here. Ugh. I might have to repeat this. No. Let's see. Oh, this is really good on this metal. It's coming up. That was close, huh? Wipe it off. Oh, man. I don't like to necessarily do that, but okay. It's coming up. So let's see if we've saved it. I'm going to add a little bit of the, the uh, black pearl right in here. Just to give it some... Hmm? You know? Is that white? Let me dip a little bit of that white. Oh, that might be house paint. Oh, never mind. All I did was put a little bit of my cell activator, a tip. Let's see what happens. If I can't fix it here, which I don't like that, I'm gonna I'm gonna wipe it off, y'all, and start over because I'm not I don't like this right here. I can live with this. Let's see what happens when I spin it. I didn't spin yet, and I'm gonna cut off some of this big paper right here because when I spin it around, it might hit something since it's not in the tub. There we go. This is just wax paper, and y'all, it's the best thing since white bread. White bread. You ready? Let's see. All right, let's open it up. Let's see what happens to that funky black. Hmm. It is pretty. I'm liking it. I'm wondering. modify it just a hair more. Okay. Not going to touch over here. Alright, I like this. So this is what I'm going to do, and as you can see, I'll bring it up. It's very, very beautiful. 
and I think this would look pretty in a kitchen or in a bathroom. It's one of those modern neutrals, and everything on the side is dripping off, so I will leave this like it is. I'm going to move it, this thing, because I can go up underneath and pick it up like this, and then move it onto a level spot, which I have ready. Okay, well, hang on just a sec and we'll do the others. I'll be right back. Okay, y'all, I'm back. Um, I had to put the tape and everything around. If you see any white, like, oop, right there, that's down below. It's not going to matter. Everything else above is dry. So that's all I'm going to worry about right now. So let's just go on. Oh, the other one is just, I'm going to call it blooming beautifully. All right. I really, 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 really like this black. I'm kind of surprised at how, per not really surprised, but I love how it's turning out. I like what it, how, what it adds. You know what I mean? And I think I'm going to go differently, like this is moving, and I don't know why, but it is. We'll just kind of do a checkerboard. Let's add a little bit more. Let's get more on the stick. There we go. Okay, then we're going to add our gold bronze. Let's switch it and start down here. All right. Got a little bit of that mix on there. Let's add the beautiful ocean mix. We'll do that that way too. It's just not coming off. I think it's kind of thickened up a little bit. And our beautiful highlighting gold. It's definitely beautiful. I think putting it this way with the black the way it is might have been a better choice. You can see more of it in between. So I don't know. All right. Shake, 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 shake. All right. I'm going to put this on. Just enough. And then some, maybe. Okay. You ready? Here we go. I don't see any any bubbles, so let's go for it. Ready? All right. Let's see how that. I don't know how I did it here. Oh, it's not coming up. Let's see. I don't know. Bag nabbit. This is where I learn, y'all. This is where I learn. Okay. You gotta learn. Push come to shove. We'll see what that looks like. <laughs> I think it's already gonna be scraped. Y'all, I've already messed this one up. Let's just do it. It's not gonna, I'm not gonna be able to fix that one. All right, so we're good. So this is catching it, and this is why you, why you do things, why you experiment, why you learn. You do the best you can with what you got. And sometimes my brain, it ain't got. I'm trying not to touch, so let's... Let's do it again. Let's go that way, why not? Okay, there we go, now we got it. So I'm gonna go one direction. And we're just going to go. Do -do. All right. Oh, the 
ragweed around here is driving me nuts, literally. It's driving me nuts. Anybody else have trouble with ragweed? I do. It's like that and cedar. When I lived in Texas, oh my gosh, the cedar tore me up every fall. Spring, spring doesn't bother me near as much as the fall. But yeah, no. Okay, now we're going to put our, our gold bronze. We'll slip that beside it. Do I hope I push? Yeah, I push the record button. <laughs> Life happens. Oh, got to try to make sure I get those edges. We're going to put the pretty ocean mix. It definitely has a different color, so um, more seen when it's. Um, oh, that's pretty. And our beautiful gold again. What is that called? Gold Jewel by Naked Fusion Pigments. You can get those on, um, just type in on Amazon. That's where I get them. Y'all haven't figured out how to put links in. You would think. But my kids are good at stuff like that, but I'm technically challenged. We're just going to put it like that. Oh, that's so pretty. I see a couple dots this time. We'll just go ahead and get them before they become monsters. Sometimes they do. Yep. You get a clean paper towel. You know I go through paper towels, right? Gee whiz, man, that follows me. Do, do, do. All right. Need some prayers. Let's get it right this time. I mean, you would think that it's, it is big enough, right? So here we go. Y'all ready? I think I got it that time. I'm not going to worry too much about the other. Oh, why aren't you coming here? Come on, y'all. It's so pretty like that, right? Let's move it this way and see what happens. There we go. Man, it's nice moving it with it. Oh, there. <gasps> I will tell y'all. Y'all saw what I did. I did it good. If at first you don't succeed, oh, Lord have mercy, right? <laughs> okay. This is becoming a long video, and I just got paint on underneath. So, guys, I'm going to have to stop. I'll be back. Got to clean that up. Okay, I'm aggravated. Yeah. So, don't do that again, right? Let's see if I can do this faster now. Maybe that's what it is. Maybe I was playing golf the other day. Not playing golf. I was playing at it we were only shooting some balls honestly was not playing golf hadn't played in eight years so anyhow and every time I tried to work tried to think about it I says I just gotta quit thinking about it and just doing it I would hit better now mind you I can't play golf and in the long run it made my hands hurt like crazy and so you know it's just not worth it for me to do it anymore to hit it long range now to putt and pitch and do all that kind of fun stuff I didn't think I'd like golf. I wish I had found golf earlier in life because I absolutely adore playing golf. And I can't do it anymore because my hands, my wrists, my thumbs, you know, the body rebels. And yeah, it's rebelled. So, oh well. There's worse things in life. I can do other things like art. Right? I can do art. I have fun doing it too. It's like my favorite job. 
I'm a registered nurse. I'm not working. I've had a lot go on health-wise and just have decided not to go back. And so I'm fixing to retire, I guess. But I love nursing. It was such a blessing to me. And I was thankful that I was able to bless others while I was um, doing it. So um, it's definitely a calling. And I started late in life. taught um, kind of grade school for 12 years while my kids were in school as a, um, in a private school, private setting. And then decided to go back. I was actually... 40 years old, I went back to school and got my nursing, got my RN. It took me a while, especially military and moving, but, you know, it moved with us. So here we go, guys. I'm not going to think too hard. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. Oh, maybe I did it. Maybe I did it this time. I think I did. We're just not going to think so hard. Boy, that was a rabbit trail to get around to what I was talking about, huh? Now I proudly say I'm an artist, struggling at times, <laughs> and this time I am going to pay attention. I'm pouring it towards me so that I can let it kind of roll this way a little bit. All right, now I'm going to spin it a little bit. This turned out really pretty. Got two more to do. You think we can? I didn't plan for this to be a long video, but dang nabbit, huh? Let's see if it pops up here. Yep, there they come. There they come. And I've got it set up on the other side. Let me get a stick over here to kind of get some of these bigger drips since I've dripped on it a lot. There. I'm not even going to worry about that. Okay, y'all ready to see that gorgissimo stuff? Isn't that pretty? Look how pretty it turned out. So, okay, and remember, it's just the top I'm worried about, so I'm not even worried about those sides. So, normally... You know, here we go. I'll be right back, y'all. Oh, they're so pretty. Wait till you see the others together. I'll take take you over when I'm done. Okay. So, <laughs> here's my little scraper. I'm going to kind of scrape that that way. Scrape that that way. Y'all, this really, let me just move it all, right? There. This is really a neat, a neat idea. I don't want it all on one side, so I guess I will bring it. That way it's more balanced. Okay. Get it out of the way. This is a neat idea. I'm kind of excited about it. Okay. Here we go. Y'all ready? Doo, doo, doo. I don't imagine it's going to take long to dry. Let's just kind of do it this way a little bit and bring it around. Let's uh, pop the biggies because they'll come up up underneath. All right, I'm ready. Remember, don't think too hard. Just do it. I do love the way that this is going. Okay. Da -da 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 -da. Just out of curiosity, I'd like to know if you would leave me a comment and tell me what your favorite combinations are. Of course, I like anything with aquas, any blues, any oceans, any of that kind of stuff I love. But I can't say that I hate a color. I like certain shades. Like, I love oranges, but I like them to be more bright. Like a vermilion reddish orange. I like um, tangerine. I mean, pumpkin's cute. I like it, but it's not my favorite. You know, if you're talking about tones, um, so there we go, our gold. And uh, so message me and let me know. And if you want me to do certain colors, just, you know, let me know on that stuff because I'll be glad to do it. We can maybe do something together. I've got a... Uh, share page. It's called Let's Share Happy Art, and it's on Facebook. So just ask to be, to join. That's just one of those things. Read the the rules and all that fun stuff like they all do. And then uh, 
I'll put you in the group, okay? Um, anyhow, maybe we can do a, a thing through the group page where we can do a fun challenge for just the group, okay? I've been thinking of lots of ideas. I'd like to do maybe a class on YouTube that just for the group page. Um, you can tell your friends to join if they want to join, but I thought maybe on, um, what is it? Uh, did I get it all in? I did. Um, what's it called? Zoom. Um, I'm putting this on. Zoom, maybe we could do a Zoom class and have a question and answer maybe. I mean, I think we can do it you know, free. I mean, it's free, and it's, uh, I think, zoom.us, okay? Oh, did I move that? Let me move it back out, or, oh, I moved this. There we go. All right, y'all. Don't think too hard, Tammy. Don't think too hard. Just do it. Okay, might have thought hard again. Oh, no, it's coming up. It's doing it. It's easier also if you wipe this off immediately, then you don't have a big fat mess. Look, it's working! Yay! Let's kind of blow a little bit. I'm thinking I'm leaving a little bit of pressure. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move it this way just a little and hold on to it so it doesn't go and move it this way. It is starting to develop, so yay. And let that finish developing. That is so pretty. It's pretty uniform, too, which is kind of neat to have them. That one's a little different, that first one, but hey, this is super duper. And what am I doing? I'm pulling that tape. Did I touch it? <laughs> All right. Let's call that done. I'm not going to touch it. It's dripping like crazy on the other side, but I'm not care. I don't care. All right, I'll be right back, and we'll do that last one. I'll show you them all together. Okay, there we go. Let's move you over there out of the way, right? All right. I like that. I mean, I'm only, you know, it's, it cost a whole dollar, that thing, and I have beat it up. I practice stuff on it, and there we go. Last one. Look at my gloves. They're miserable when they get this way. So, here we go. Last one. Everything's on. Yep. I feel like something went up underneath. No, oh, it doesn't matter. All right, here we go. Let's add that. Like that, like that, and a little spin. There we go. Yeah, that napkin. And when I get napkins, I only get little pieces. This is like a doggy roll. It was for our puppies. We've got lots of them. All right, here comes the pearl black. Let's get it done. We're not gonna think hard. That first one, I, I don't know. It does look different, so we'll see if I do it again. I don't know. This is the turquoise silver mix. Next one's my gold bronze, which is a beautiful color. Oop! Where'd that paper towel go? Don't want the white back in my hat. Okay, come on, I know you're there. There you go. Oh. The ocean and cactus green mix. And y'all, it is different. Yeah, I see bubbles coming up. Oops. Oh, I'm such a ditz. There we go. Quit it. I'm really not a ditz, y'all. I just have moments. My CD skips just a little bit for those of you old enough to understand that. There's a little gnat. And so what if my CD skips, right? It always goes back on track eventually. 
And sometimes it doesn't, and you know what? I really don't care. I might not even notice that it didn't come back. <laughs> Which is okay. Okay. Let's put our white on. Y'all ready? I'm ready. Last one, y'all. Last one. Hopefully. <laughs> then I'll bring you over. I'm hoping this isn't a long video. I kind of stopped it. Any bubbles? Yep. Let me, while that's sitting, big bubbles. If I can see them big enough. There we go. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Make sure the edge. You ready? I wipe that on the side of my trash can first and then I'll take my clean towel and clean that off. It just makes it easier. It is looking pretty. Hello, hello, pretties. Here we go. Then I'm going to move it forward again. Oops, here's some. But I have learned my lesson. We're going to do it like that. Just so it doesn't decide to come. That's pretty. I don't trust myself. All right, before I move that, I'm just going to spin it one little time. One little time. Maybe two. <laughs> Go the other direction. All right. Y'all, that's gorgeous. Let's look at it up close. See how pretty that turned out. There is a little gnat in my face, and I'm fixing to slap it. All right. I'm going to go put this on the other side, take the camera down so you can see them all together. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, y'all. These are the four together. There's the first one right there. I believe this is the second. That one is the third. And this one we just did, so it's still developing. Anyhow, these are gorgeous, gorgeous. They turned out beautifully. And I will let you see them when they're dry. I'm praying that there's no cracking or anything when they dry. And um, there we go. Um, they should do okay. I used my GAC 100, uh, 800. I think they're going to be really good. And um, anyhow, so I've got some other ideas. I hope it'll work. So we'll see. And then I will resin them and just do a, um, oh, what is it called? It's kind of like a mound. Oh, any other any other time I could tell you, you know. Anyhow, y'all, I'm so excited that this turned out. They're very beautiful. I love them, and I think they're going to make beautiful lids. And anyhow, if you're interested, let me know. These are for the sale, but I will definitely make you some. I have no issues doing that. And if you want to buy these, just PM me at happyartcreations at gmail.com. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Share it with your friends. Listen longer. That's a big deal with YouTube, and it ends up being a big deal for me, too, then. And if you would, subscribe if you're not already we have fun on it and you can subscribe on facebook at, oh no 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 you could subscribe on the youtube uh, go in there and hit the bell for all notifications and you'll get all my notifications of my upcoming videos as they come along as when they post and we have of course our page that's let's share happy art tell your friends and uh, share that with your arty, artsy fartsy friends and we'll just have a good old time there and if you are a subscriber i thank you Okay, guys, you know how it is. Let's make sure that today and every day you're out and about spark some happy in somebody's life. That might even be your husband. Sometimes they just need a good, hey, how you doing? You know, life's been hard lately, you know, for everybody, including our loved ones. So anyhow, spark some happy in somebody's heart today because you never know how you might uh, reach them, um, how you may touch their hearts. They just want to be seen. They just want to be heard. So, okay, guys, I'll see you next time here on Happy Art Creations. Toodaloo. Bye-bye. Goodbye now.